Hi hi Here is a zen story today for overcoming anger So once there was a zen student who went to his master and said Master I have an ungovernable temper Please help me get rid of it So the master said My son you have something very strange show it to me The student said Sorry master I cannot show it to you right now Why not asked the master The student said It is not here at the moment master it is not with me all times it rises suddenly within me then the teacher replies then it cannot be your own nature son if it were you will be able to show it to me any time why are you allowing something that does not belong to you to trouble your life so the student realized it and thereafter whenever he the student felt his temper rising he remembered his teacher's words and checked on his anger over a period of time he developed a placid temperament it is very important to manage your anger because anger never belonged to us it was only given to us by someone or something it is not always there not all times we get angry we just get angry because of someone or something that has happened to us so if it is not within you it does not belong to you so you can very well have a control over the anger so anger management is the key so once there was a young daughter who went to her father and said Father can you tell me the difference between anger and exasperation the father said it is mostly a matter of degree let me show you what i mean and with that the father went to the telephone and dialed a number at random he then said hello is david there the man who answered the phone said There is no one living in the name of David here. Why don't you all look up the numbers properly before dialing someone? And hung up the call. See, said the father to his daughter. That man was not a bit happy because um maybe he was working, he was busy on something, so our call annoyed him. That is annoying and not anger. Now let me show you what anger is. and then he dialed the same number again and now he said hello is david there the other voice re- responds now look here with a heated reply he responded you just called this number a while ago and i said there is no one here in the name of david you've got so much guts to call the same number again and slam down hard The father turned to his daughter and said, "You see, that was anger. Now I'll show you what exasperation is." And now he dialed the same number again. And when a violent voice from the other side said, "Hello," the father calmly said, "Hello, this is David here. Have there been any calls for me?" Imagine yourself receiving such calls you would exactly know what exasperation means